Thank you, Chair. Uh, dear colleagues, dear Commissioner, uh, the President von der Leyen has made a big promise today to women and girls in Europe. She will propose a law to combat gender-based violence from prevention to protection and effective prosecution, both online and offline. That is a big promise, considering that already in October 2015, the Commission had promised a framework for combating violence against women. The EU accession to the Istanbul Convention is still on hold to this day, which is absolutely shameful. And, uh, of course, we would hope that the uh, Commission would not repeat the mistakes of the past. We do not want promises, we want action. This report asks for the inclusion of gender-based violence in the list of crimes under Article 83. Uh, this would only be one small step in the right direction. What the women and girls need is a comprehensive legal framework which focuses on prevention through education programming directed at both boys and girls, protection measures, psychological support, shelters and access to social housing, specialist support for children, and legal clarification of custody and visitation rights for children, civil consequences of forced marriages, stalking, including cyber stalking, and denial of reproductive rights and denial of access to reproductive health care. The Commission should also make pressure on member states to properly implement already existing legislation. And here we, members of the Parliament, also have a role to play. This is not enough to vote for the report. We can and have also to put pressure on our own governments to educate our people, to make it clear that we are caring not just here in the hemicycle, but also in real everyday life. Thank you.